Amno Supreme Council member Lokman Noor Adam believes that the Reformasi movement won't be considered as a success until former Premier Dr. Mahathir Mohamad has been charged in court. Speaking as a panelist at a forum to mark the movement's 25th anniversary last night, Lokman argued that the Reformasi movement has yet to succeed. Sebabnya reformasi kita yang dimulakan tu ialah kita nak menghapuskan amalan kronisma, nepotisma dan korupsi yang diamalkan oleh Mahdi. Tetapi sehingga hari ini ramai orang dah berjadi mangsa Mahdi. Tapi sampai sekarang kita tak boleh hirit Mahdi ni walaupun dah 25 tahun. Eh? So bagi saya lah kalau nak mengukur kejayaan uh, reformasi ni setidak-tidaknya kita kena hirit dia dakwa dia di mahkamah. Setuju tak setuju? Ha. During his speech, Lokman also recounted how he was introduced to the term reformasi as an UMNO youth member in 1996. The movement was then led by UMNO youth chief Ahmad Zahid Hamidi. Lokman said Zahid had, at the time, introduced the theme Pemuda Pemangkin Gerakan Reformasi to support Anwar Ibrahim, who was the Deputy Prime Minister and Finance Minister, as well as UMNO's number two. The movement was aimed at challenging the alleged corruption linked to Dr. Mahathir, who was serving as Prime Minister and AMNO President. According to Lokman, AMNO youth had been outspoken then and fought against corruption, chronism and nepotism, which eventually led to Anwar Ibrahim's sacking in 1998. Lokman was among AMNO youth leaders who were sacked along with Anwar, and they came together as the earliest supporters of what eventually founded PKR's predecessor, Parti Keadilan Nasional in 1999.